Hello everyone, my name is Amaranth and I play games for the internet, and today we're playing Slay the Spire. Alright, I know I said that uh, every time that there would be a new daily climb, uh, I'd, um, <clears throat> I'd record myself doing it, but I didn't record myself doing this one. Because it was late at night, and I just wanted to unwind. And I did it. I died really fast, if it makes anybody feel any better. <laughs> about missing it. You, you, you didn't miss much. <clears throat> so, instead we're gonna do a standard! And we're gonna stick with old Ironclad here. Our good friend. And let's just go. Hello again. I don't know if you can hear that, but that's Harley throwing a shit fit because he's not allowed in our room. In our room. My room. <laughs> I do not share my room with anyone. And I picked... Yeah, Meow's Lament for our thing. And we're gonna go in the middle. And... F I can't really call these much of fights. You know? Oh, why would you do this to me? Ugh! Anger. And you... Blink, blink. <laughs> hmm. As you walk into the room, you hear a gurgling and the grinding of metals. Before you is a slime like creature that ate too much scrap for its own good. From the center of the creature, you see glints of strange light. Perhaps something magical? It looks like you can get some treasure if you just reach inside its... opening. However, the acid and sharp objects may hurt. Reach inside, lose 3 HP, but there's a 25% chance we'll find a relic. Never tell me the odds! Ouch! All you find is corroded metal and a bit of burning pain. However, you're still convinced there's a relic. Deeper, lose 4 HP, 35% chance to find a relic. Yes! Success! After rummaging through the metal and burning acid, you finally grab a hold of a relic and yank it out. You pull your way out of the ooze, damaged but rewarded. With Vajra. At the start of each combat, gain 1 strength. Hell yeah. <laughs> Question mark. <laughs> you fall into a puddle. It's made of slime goop. Frantically, you claw yourself out over several minutes as you feel the goop starting to burn. You can feel goop in your ears, goop in your nose, goop everywhere. Climbing out, you notice that some of your gold is missing. Looking back to the puddle, you see your missing coins combined with a gold some that combined with gold from unfortunate adventurers mixed together in the puddle. I don't want to lose 20 gold. <laughs> Gain 75 gold, lose 11 HP. Feeling the sting of the goop as the prolonged exposure starts to melt away at your skin, you manage to fish out the gold. I... <clears throat> I know what I'm about to do is really dumb, but I'm going to go this way. And... Cool. Oh shit, that wasn't the one I wanted. Whatever.
Okay, first, intimidate, then anger, strike. Confused? Drink. Strike. 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 Defend. Ow. So I'll defend. Siphon soul because fuck you, I guess. Anger. Strike. Strike. Defend for no reason. I'm playing very recklessly. And think that I'm going to die very quickly. And because of that, I apologize. But you know what? Anger. Anger. Strike. <sighs> Mollified hand. When you play a power when you play a power, a random card in your hand costs zero for the turn. I dig it. And we're gonna go this way. <laughs> As you come to a dead end and begin to turn around, walls slam down from the ceiling, trapping you. Three faces materialize from the walls and speak. Forget what you know, and I'll let you go. I require change to see a new space. If you want to pass me, then you must grow. And let's grow. Mm. What does ethereal mean anyway? If this card is in your hand at the end of a turn, it is exhausted. Oh. Satisfied, the walls in front of you merge back into the ceiling, leaving a path forward. Money. I don't need a card removal. Yes. We start each combat with a 10 block. Okay. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go this way. I'm gonna rest. Okay. Question mark, question mark, and then fight, fight. Okay. find a shimmering mass of light encompassing the center of the room. Its warm glow and enchanting patterns invite you in. Enter, upgrade to random cards, and lose 16 HP. 
Yep. As you walk through the light, you notice th that the light is absorbed into you. It's scorching hot. However, the pain quickly recedes. You feel invigorated, as though you received a well-deserved slap. Mm -hmm. Well, it's a fight, damn it. At least it's only one of these jerks. Stolen back. It's swift potion. Flame barrier. And a fight. No fungi beasts. Oh, balls. Well, there goes Carnage. Ugh. This guy is just gonna buff himself, blah, 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 blah. Weak potion, fourteen gold, and a card. Flex. Fight. Mm, it's just these little furry caterpillar dudes. That was irritating. Mm. How do I spit web? <laughs> and there's a joke that does kind of old in internet terms and you know what we're just gonna we're gonna rest and fight this goopy slime boss jackass I should have put vulnerable on him first but you know what Mm. 
corrosive spit. Who gives wounds? And this guy gives frail. Yep. Interrupted. Ugh. So I'm really enjoying recording these, but I'm also like aware that I'm not entertaining when I record them. Which I understand and I'm sorry. Um I guess I'm still just gonna keep going because I'm enjoying myself. <laughs> and why the heck not, right? If I'm having fun, I'm not hurting anyone, I guess. Well, it might be hurting you guys, but y'all can stop watching whenever you like. But, uh, anyway. Yep. Ugh. It's cold. It was really nice out earlier. It was kind of sunny, even though it was super chilly. But, um,. Now it's just like it's the sun's starting to go down. It's cold. Blech. <laughs> I don't trust Pandora's box. It transforms all strikes and defends. I don't like that. Then we've got Runic Dawn. Gain energy at the start of each turn. You can no longer see enemy intents. I'm still not good enough that I can do without that. Philosopher's Stone. Gain energy at the start of each turn. All enemies start with plus two strength. Let's go with that, even though it will kill us. We're gonna die so hard, it's gonna be great. Good adventures go left. Yes. I've got magic in here. Cause he was being a bit of a jerk earlier. So he's in here with me, while my housemate takes a rest. My poor housemate, man. <laughs> it's like, Magic, why can't you be good to your mom, huh? But no. And now magic has stolen my heating pad. I complain a lot about him, but he's a good kid. A good kid, I say, as though I was talking about, you know, a normal human child and not an eight-year-old cat. <laughs> Anger plus. Yes. I am totally about that life. Oh, God. Oh, why would you do this to me? For 
there's a merchant up there. Question marks. Scaling the city, you notice a wall covered in the writing of ancients. As you try to wrap your head around what the puzzling symbols and glyphs could mean, the writing begins to glow. Suddenly, the message becomes clear. Remove a card from your deck, or upgrade all strikes and defense. Now, we don't have anything we really need to remove, so let's go with simplicity and upgrade all our strikes and defense. The truth is always simple. Leave. Fight. These obnoxious birds. Freaking dramatic. And now they're gonna buff themselves. He's stunned. Oh, whoops. Wow, this sucks. Oh god. Question mark? Oh, merchant. Probably should have. I probably could have bought a relic, but no. I make very, very bad mistakes. I'm gonna die. dead. I'm totally dead. This is... <sighs> this has been a terrible... T terrible... Oh... This has just been a This has been a bad run. Yep, there it is. I'm sorry, you guys. Defeat. Just my luck. No, no, Ironclad. It was my fault. I don't know what it was about today. This, this recording. Uh, 
but we draw ever closer to that last remaining unlock. <sighs> but that is it for today's episode, or today, uh, this episode of Slay the Spire. And I hope you guys will come back after that embarrassing display. And I will see you next time for another episode of Slay the Spire. Have a good day, everyone. <laughs>